वेलकम फ्रेंड्स असली बनिया वेलकम्स यू वंस अगेन टुडे वी हैव ब्रॉट यू द आईपीओ रिव्यू ऑफ क्रांति इंडस्ट्रीज लिमिटेड क्रांति इंडस्ट्री लिमिटेड इज एस एम ई आई पी ओ विच इज गोइंग टू ओपन ऑन फोर्टीन फेब्रवरी एंड लेट सी वी शुड अप्लाई टू दिस आई पी ओ और नॉट टू अप्लाई दिस इज आवर स्टैंडर्ड डिस्कलेमर लाइक आई एम नॉट अ से बी रजिस्टर एनालिस्ट सो दिस इज दिस रिपोर्ट इज प्रिपेयर ओनली फॉर एजुकेशन पर्पजेज ओनली please before investing in this ipo please consult sebi registered investment advisor sapkranti industry limited company overview what does the company do like the company was established in 1995 and it is engaged in the business of manufacturing and supplying the precision machine components to various uh, automobile companies uh, in the past what happened kl was supplying the parts to majorly to, to tractors but like for past 2 3 years they are trying to diversify into passenger parts for passenger cars electric cars two wheeler like electrical cars has a huge potential two wheelers and construction machineries railways heavy trucks etc their automatic component have a diverse range from 100 mm to 1200 mm in size their client base if you see like most of them are at the moment are tractors tractor industries but they are they are trying to diversify into other industries as well because they started it from the last year itself now the ipo details ipo is opening up on 14th february it is closing on 20th feb the face value is 10 rupees per share lot size is 3000 shares the price band is 37 rupees per share and minimum investment is 1 lakh 11000 rupees per lot and it will be listed at bsc sme now the equity capital the current equity capital of, capital of kranti industries is 7.05 crores the issue size is 23.1 lakh shares means 2.31 crore of equity capital uh, out of this the fresh issue is um, 17.52 lakh shares and offer for sale is 5.67 lakh shares so proposed new equity will be 1.75 crores and the total new equity post post ipo is 8.8 crore now uh, objects of the issue the objects of the issue is like to meet the working capital requirement and general corporate expenses and the issue expenses now looking now we look at the financials if you see the financial like uh, in the year 2018 the top line was around 46 crores which for the first half year of 2019 is 33 crores the profit uh, after tax is uh, Two crores, and if you see, like uh, there was losses in year 2016 and 17, so th- they had some reason for it. Basically, uh, uh, we'll explain it in the next slide itself. Now, looking at the cash flow, cash flow. If you see, the op- op- company was generating good amount of cash flows, uh, operating cash flows from operating activities. However, they were spending money. A, a, from investing activities and from the financial activities now the view like positive the one of the positive is like uh, kranti industries the auto ancillary unit future is very good because the consumption is going to increase and uh, every year the auto sales are going up the current order book is around 6.6 crores the company like in year 2016 what happened is like the company has to post loss because uh, of setback in uh, and lower offtake in the tractor sectors and then they decided to diversify in other sectors the other automobiles and heavy equipment so like in 2016 their dependence on tractor sector was 85% now they have started to reduce so which is a very good a uh, positive at this point the negative is like company has not paid any dividend because uh, of the financial issues in the past and like uh, i have already explained like in the year 2016 and 17 they were not able to make profit 2016 there was a setback due to lower offtake by tractor industry and even fy17 they posted loss because they were installing new machinery and uh, the product development costs so they had a th- little bit higher interest and depreciation cost which led to the loss now competitors they have mentioned is like uh, endurance technologies mm forging bharat forge and ricota basically these are 
आर नॉट कंपेरेबल टू क्रांति इंडस्ट्रीज बट दे हैव शोन इन दी एच आर पी ना फाइनल रिव्यू लाइक द कंपनी इज सक्सेसफुली ट्राइंग टू डाइवर्सिफाई Uh, to other automobile industries which is quite good the pe currently the ipo price of 37 is at pe of 12 which is a very reasonably priced offer because for auto ancillary industries if you see the pe range is around uh, 25 to 30 so our view is that investor with low risk capital should apply in this ipo however uh, listing gains probability is very low or there might be a small loss uh, due to the volatile nature of the market uh, currently so thank you friends and if you liked my presentation you can subscribe to my channel by clicking on the link below the blue color arrow and thank you and see you next time